Hey, good morning, guys. It's like 8.30, maybe almost 9 o'clock. I don't know. I'm not in a room where there's a 8 o'clock. I'm in my mom's bathroom right now because uh, she's got the most light in here right now. So I thought I would just do it this video in here. Um, this isn't a tutorial. This is I'm just going uh, to talk about and explain um, my shoes that I just did. That I recently finished, actually. And I thought I would share them with everybody. Uh... I'll show you guys. I did these awesome um, for Christmas shoes. You can see them. It's Jack and Sally. And I did her pattern of her dress, a kitty cat, and then the pattern of her sock on hers. His, I did um, bats zero and then bats on the other side. Two different kinds of shades of purple because I like purple. And when you buy like them for Christmas stuff, it's usually purple so I was like well that would go good with the concept of what I was doing but yeah I got these um, shoes last year and I got two pairs actually of uh, white uh, bands I got the slip-ons and then I got um, the ones that tie uh, I've been wanting to do these for a long time since I saw a picture on uh, online it was somebody who did a uh, very very freaking amazing if I can find it I'll probably show you if I can't then sorry but it was an amazing uh, painting job I believe they painted on their shoes with a um, jack theme like knife Christmas theme and it was really fantastic so I'm like I really want to do that on my shoes so um, I finally got these last year and I just finished them last week I have been I know I've been procrastinating a lot not really procrastinating, but I wanted to make sure my shoes turned out good because I didn't want to mess up a like $60 pair of shoes and then me not wanting to wear them. So I was researching of what kind of um, product to use. And because I didn't know if there was a specific kind that you had to use for these kind of type of things, but pretty much everybody either used like spray paint or um, paint or markers, something like that. I used I used um, acrylic paint because um, I thought that's pretty much all I had that I knew wouldn't bleed because um, I knew markers would and then permanent markers tend to bleed when you try to draw on like material like this but um, if you're going to paint with acrylic paint I don't know if that's just me but if don't use a lot of water to, um, to dip your brush in to dip into the paint because um, it will bleed, uh, it will like spread, because it did that on a few of, um, on his, like what I did to him, his, uh, fat bow tie, it kind of, if you can see, somewhere over here, it, uh, expanded because I used a little too much water. So I would just use a tiny, tiny bit of water if you want to make, uh, your paint last a little bit longer on here, but, um, yeah, um, I did these just last week. I finished them. I wore them pretty much all the time because I'm lazy and I really don't like to tie my shoes. So I like to slip on shoes and these were perfect and I wanted to wear them because you were just sitting there collecting dust. And before they got ruined, I was like, well, I need to do those. So I finally did them yesterday. It took me about four days to do these. Uh, two days on each shoe because um, it took me about a day to do the front part. And then it took me that second day to do the side and the back on both, pretty much. Because I had to sit there and think about what I wanted to do the image on. And I don't want to copy everybody else's that you see on um, people that do their shoes. And I haven't really seen anybody do this one yet. And if they do, it's fine. But I, I babysit. And my the girl I babysit for is a fan of um, Never Christmas 2. And her baby bag was this image. And I loved it, so I was like, I, you know what, I'm going to do that on my shoe. So I did that one on my shoe, and then I just looked up a picture of Sally, and I drew it on here. Uh, I What I did was, um, I sketched it out on a piece of paper first, so I knew where it was going to be placed. And then I just very lightly with a pencil sketched out the image of Jack and Sally, and then after I got it sketched, I went in with a pen, a liquid pen. And I outlined the um, I outlined Jack and Sally and did all the detail. 
I actually, well, I painted, I didn't do too much detail when I did that. I painted first, then I went back in with the marker or the pen and did the little details and, you know, the first stitches, stitches in her dress and her eyes and hair and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much what I did. I just used, like I said, acrylic paint, uh, very little water, uh, a uh, ink pen, like a liquid pen, and then a pencil. Just do it very lightly so that if you mess up, you can go over it again and redo it. So, yeah, these are my awesome shoes. I'm very proud of them, and all my friends and family are proud. And if I show you those, it's a pattern of her sock and kitty cat. Her and her dress pattern, and vice versa again. That's zero bets. Um, one more thing, a lot of people ask me if I have a website, because I put these on Facebook, and then I'll put the link if you want to add me on Facebook. Um, people have been asking me if I uh, have a website for these. I don't, because this is my first pair of shoes that I did. And um, for in order for me to sell, um, like, Nightmare for Christmas and stuff like that, I'd have to get a copyright, because it's copyright, so I'd have to get a license to do that, so I can sell, like, the stuff. And one of my um, mom's friends was telling me that um, I can get a license or I can get the license to do to sell the work. It will cost me like three hundred dollars, which just isn't bad. I thought it would be way more, but um, I might look into doing that because I can start selling stuff like this. Because I want to start um, making like hair bows and uh, maybe some shoes and maybe some bags or something. And uh, I might do that, and so I can. Make a little extra money and not waste my talent away like my parents are saying. Because <laughs> technically I kind of am. I'm just sitting here making YouTube videos and not doing really much. But, um, yeah, I'm going to probably do that. Uh, so, if I do, I will probably put a link up to the website if I ever decide to do one and can, uh, get the copyright uh, license to do that but yeah I don't have a um I'm gonna do some for my uh, friends though and my family because they're family because um one of my mom's friends birthday is coming up and her partner wanted me to um do a pairs of Jack and Sally shoes as well because she's a, a big fan of him too so I'm gonna do that for her birthday and then one of my other friends um asked me to do some so she has to give me the shoes they have to see they have to give me the shoes for it and then I'll do it because I'm not about to pay 60 bucks for everybody's shoes and then me not get anything back for that because then I have to charge way more for the shoe because it'd be like probably about a hundred dollars I'd probably have to charge maybe if they didn't buy me the shoe because that's a lot of money that I'm spending and I won't make anything so I mean, think each year might ten dollars maybe I don't know yet I haven't decided how much I'm gonna charge people if I do that. But yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys like my shoes. And my mom's cat. <laughs> I'm sure you guys can see. I'll show you real quick. Hi, Charlie. Anyway, guys, talk to you later. Bye.